HTTV with Absolute Warehouse Services, joined by Harry Spratt today, ahead of the Under-19 game against Rochdale tomorrow. Harry, thanks for joining us, first of all. And this is the first time we spoke to you for HTTV since you joined Huddersfield Town in April. So for fans that might not know a lot about you, Harry, just explain your career today, where you've been and, and um, when you ended I've, up here. I've been at Manchester United over there since about um, eight years old. So and then over there until under 17. Mm. And I joined here just last year, yeah. Yeah, and from Leeds originally played for Rothwell Juniors, is that right? Rothwell so? Town, it was. Rothwell Town, yeah, sorry. I played yeah, for okay. Rothwell Town when I was young, yeah, when I was seven, six, seven. Mm. So I joined Manchester United from there. Yeah. So a big move for you, obviously. You spent a lot of your life at Manchester United, never yeah, mind your career. Yeah, I used to go up and I used to take me over when I was younger. And then under 16, I joined like full time. And I moved over to Manchester, yeah, lived in Diggs there. So when you were looking to, to make your next step in your career, what was it about Huddersfield Town that appealed to you? Well, it just like I spoke to Lee and he told me the plan, you know, the changes that the club were making, mm -hmm. and it just sounded very interesting, very good. Mm. So, it's something that I'd like to be part of. Excellent. And obviously, you have been since April, and this season in particular, just looking at your stats this season, you played 14 games already, which for someone at under 19 level, it's quite a lot of games, isn't it? I mean, just compare it to a lot of players at Man United. I imagine it's the most games you've ever played in a, in a yeah, short Yeah, well, time. yeah, definitely, yeah. I've enjoyed coming in. Mm. And I, I've been able to get into the team and I've been enjoying the football, yeah, it's been good. And for fans that might not have seen you play yet, obviously a left sided defender, so yeah. centre half or left back, have you got a preference either way? Or? Um, I played left back a lot at Man United, but since I've come here, I've been more of a centre back and that's where Mark Hudson sees me, so I've enjoyed that, yeah. It's Excellent. Just to give fans an idea of, of the games programme you guys are playing, there's, there's a whole set of different challenges. So even just this year, you've been playing at the likes of Bradford Park Avenue, playing their senior team, yeah. all the way to being in Portugal to play Braga and, uh, and those kinds of guys. Just give us an example of, of what that's been like for you. I mean, first of all, to talk about Portugal, I mean, you go out there, you play Braga, you play Celta Vigo, it must be a hell of an experience. Yeah, there's been lots of like, different experiences. We've been, as you say, playing non-league teams, like, like feel of them type of games, like playing against men, senior football, mm. and they've been good, and we've been to Portugal as well, yeah, playing against more like technical players, mm. like the experience of just going over there and just like the hotel, like a different feel to it, yeah. Mm. Not to generalise, but if you play a centre half and you're playing senior non-league sides, that must be a, a different experience for you, Harry, from academy football. Yeah, it is, yeah, it's a lot <laughs> different, like, because like, the brag, like the type of players that we play, they're more like technical, probably like better on the ball, different, different styles of play, like, mm. it's, it's good, yeah, good experience. That's the idea, isn't it, really? Because ultimately, if, if you're going to play for the Seal Town in the Premier League, you're going to get both types of challenge, aren't you? Technical and physical. Yeah, definitely, yeah. Different types of players. It's good to be exposed to different types of football and different styles. Yeah. You mentioned Mark Hudson, and obviously he's the guy who takes you day to day and, and you're playing for him. Uh, sees you as a centre-half. Not a bad centre half himself, Mark. Obviously, did really well for Huddersfield yeah. Town. Had a fantastic career. So, what's it like having someone that's that's trod your path, teaching you? Yeah, I think it's very good. Like someone to look up to, like Lee as well. Mm -hmm. Lee and Mark have both been there, have great careers. Mm -hmm. So it's good to like learn from people, especially the centre. They're both defenders, weren't they? So it's mm -hmm. good for us, like as me as a defender. Mm -hmm. To be able to learn from them. And look up to them yeah. You look at it like that because, in one way, it can give you loads of advice, in the other way, he knows exactly where a good centre half is. There's a bit more pressure on you in that sense. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, it's good, it's good, yeah. It's yeah excellent. Good to have them both there. So we're looking ahead to tomorrow, obviously we're playing Rochdale here at PPG Canal side. We're expecting a few senior players in Rochdale's side, so again, uh, be a real physical test for you and the team. How much are you looking forward to that? Yeah, I'm really looking forward to it. It's another game, like another challenge. Like, might play a different style to what we've been playing, so mm. it'll be good. Mm. And beyond tomorrow, what are your hopes for the rest of the season? Obviously you're contracted here for the, for the entire season. Yeah, yeah, I am, yeah. My hopes for the rest of the season to carry on playing games and keep playing, then hopefully in January maybe look out to get on loan. The number of games that you are playing, how different is it to what you had at United? Because there's, there's a lot of players in the academy system at United, isn't there? So yeah, is it a change? There's, yeah, there's a difference, like, there's a big difference. Like, since I've come here, I've played a lot more and I'm like, enjoying football and that. And like, United do a lot more like players, so it was like, harder to get in the team. Has, has it been a change physically for you? Because it is demanding, isn't it, playing games, ultimately? Yeah, like, I think this season I've got used to it more and I'm like, enjoying playing. I think my body's adapted as well to like, the games and things, yeah. Excellent. Well, Harry, good luck tomorrow and, and thanks for joining us. Yeah, cheers, thank you.